Hi everybody, now let's see how to get the most out of chat and GPT for using QGIS, ArcMap, or could be ArcGIS Pro. For example, uh, I will start with uh, QGIS. In this folder, I have some layers to do some geoprocess. First of all, I recommend you that copy the address of the folder. For example, I have this folder and I say in uh, chat GPT, I have this folder uh, with some layers and I want that uh, you help me to do some geoprocess in QGIS. Uh, please use the Python console. Okay. And chat and GPT give me some, some example how I can import this, this layer. Um, but it's better if you say exactly the name for each uh, layer. For example, buffer point. I copy the name and I say I have this layer. I have, uh, for example, buffer point and I want you help me to do a buffer 50 meters. I say, I send the order and chat GPT give me the code. For example, in QGIS, if you uh, see in the toolbars, you can choose the Python console. Uh, personally, I prefer show the editor. In this part, you can put the code that uh, chat GPT generate. For example, I copy, next, I paste, I select all the code and I do uh, click on this icon, run script. You can see the buffer of my points. For example, if you want to add also the buffer point, I can say, please also add buffer point layer. I send, I copy the code. I can, at the end, I can paste only select this part, uh, run, and you have <laughs> uh, the, the buffer and the point. I recommend for each uh, geoprocess that you delete or empty all code. For example, in this case, I have my point and also I have a buffer of 50 meters. Other case, for example, I have um, a clip and layers. For example, I have, I have a points and lines layers. Then I say, I copy, I have uh, clip uh, lines and uh, clip uh, points. Uh, please do a clip using, for example, a uh, clip layer polygon. And I have here the code. And copy the code, paste, uh, select all, all code, and run. Uh, right click, zoom to layer, and you can see, for example, the buffer. If I add the original layer, for, for example, clip points and uh, clip lines, and also the, the mask, in this case, clip. Uh, for example, you can see if we uh, disactivate, I have uh, this layer, for example, for points, I have all these points. Uh, only with the clip, uh, clip points. The same for lines, I have the lines, and I have the clip lines. Very nice. Also, I have uh, this layer. For example, if I add to actual view, dissolve layers, uh, right click, zoom to layer. If I open the attribute table, I can see the field ID I can use for dissolve this layer. And also I need to say to chat GPT, uh, remove layer. Okay, that I have this layer and I need to do a dissolve using ID field. Also, I have dissolve layer. Uh, please add this layer and, and do a dissolve using ID fields. I send the order. I need to copy the code, copy, paste, and run. Uh, you can see I have here my dissolve uh, layer. Open attribute table. Also, I have the common values of this uh, layer. It's the same if I want to change, for example, to our map. I can tell chat and GPT directly to do the same thing in our map. Okay. Uh, well, <laughs> uh, he told me the, the manual process, but I need the 
Python code. Also, I need to say that uh, I need the code, but I want the Python code. I have ArcMap. In ArcMap, you can go to Geoprocess menu and choose Python. And I have the console of Python. Uh, I try to copy this code, for example, copy, paste, and run. Now, I need to copy the second part, for example, copy, uh, paste, and run. You can see the buffer, the next part, copy, paste, run, and I have a, a problem. For example, uh, here I have a problem. When I have a problem, it recommend that you copy the this error and paste in chat GPT, for example, and I send. And I have some options uh, to do this process. For example, I copy, I paste. Uh, maybe the problem is because uh, I have opened these uh, layers in QGIS. I try to close QGIS, don't save anything, and I try again. Copy and paste. And for example, if I go to dissolve layer, zoom to layer, I have the dissolve layer. For clip uh, polygon, uh, zoom to layer, I have the original lines and points and also i have the clip lines and clip points you can see like chat gpt it's very fast to do this process and for example in this folder also i have uh, the intersect layers i want to do uh, intersect between uh, intersect one and intersect two and i said also i have intersect one intersect to uh, please do a uh, intersect of these layers uh, help me with python code in our map i send and also i need to to wait for the code i copy i paste the code and i have uh, the result for example intersect i deactivate all other layers here i have the area of intersect for example if i add manually the other layers intersect one and intersect uh, two and you can see uh, this layer and these layers is a intersect between two layers it's very it's very easy for example if i want to to do the same thing in rg's prom also i need to say to chat gpt please do the same in rgis pro help me with the python code i need to change to rgis pro here i have rgis pro i go to uh, view and i have python windows here also i need to copy the code and uh, maybe i need to close uh, our map and i paste uh, the code here enter here i have the same thing and you can see the same result. Also, I have other layers. For example, here tengo merge, merge one and merge two. And I say to chat GPT. Also, I have merge one and merge two. Uh, uh, please do add these layers and do a merge in RGS Pro. Help me with the code. And I have the code. For example, if I copy the code and in the next i paste and run when i have a, a problem error for example only i need to copy this error and paste in chat gpt and i send now uh, chat gpt is generating a new code i copy and try again zoom to layer and i have the result for example, if I add the first uh, layers, merge one and merge two, uh, you can see, for example, merge two and merge one. When I try to union, uh, I have the output of merge. Uh, well, <laughs> as you can see, ChatGPT helps us to carry out or to work fast. And uh, this is all that I want to show you. Thanks so much for your attention. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and help me with a like of this video. Bye.